Well, they start with a rental and then they can graduate into the ultimate grand of all grants, the Blutner. You know, one thing about my business, as I say, I've been in over 50 years. I've had literally the opportunity to have been, be inside of any pianos, I, any brand that's out there. Uh, I've had some very fine pianos I've rebuilt, some that I've restored. I selected Blutner because I felt like it was the finest piano that I had ever played or worked on. One of the things that Blutner has is called the aliquot scale. And the aliquot scale means that there are four strings per unison in the top end of the piano. And it gives this beautiful, clear, crisp sound. There's no other piano in the world that has that kind of sound and bell-like tone in the top register. Amazing, amazing. All right, let me tell you a little bit more about the Blutner. We talked about the aliquot scale, and we know what that is. The Blutner has some other things that are very, very important. The soundboard, for instance, is made by assembling uh, wood that is mined in a forest in Austria, so it's Austrian spruce. Uh, they have a three month per year growing season there. So all of the growth rings and the, the fineness of the wood is the top grade spruce in the world. Uh, they've done that for 135 years. The Blutner people have been in business since 1853. Wow. Uh, they're used in, by some of the finest concert halls in the world. It was uh, one of Franz Liszt's personal pianos. Uh, the Blutner has been used by the Beatles. Uh, that was their exclusive piano wow. uh, for doing this. More than that, the soundboard in the Blutner is, is actually fitted and crafted differently from any other piano. Almost other pianos, if we took a piece of paper and pushed down on all sides, uh, this would be how the crown in most pianos are formed. In a Blutner piano, it's, it's done naturally, curving this way, so that you don't get the cracks and problems with the Blutner soundboard that you do, that you do with other pianos. They even fit the plate so that it fits the soundboard. The plate is uh, cast iron, and so it's cooled naturally in, it, in its cast, and then it's fitted to the soundboard, so that you don't have the uh, warpage or cracking that you do with other pianos. The bridges are hand fitted. These are worked on only by master craftsmen, and a master craftsman is, a, is achieved by an apprentice working for five years. It already is a very fine piano technician, for five years under a master craftsman before he's allowed to take on that title and, and work on the Blutner pianos. Well, the world almost lost Blutner pianos at one point. You're right. During the Second World War, as uh, you're aware, the uh, Allies bombed Germany mercilessly, and particularly some cities. And uh, Leipzig, Germany is where Blutner was made, and that was one of those cities. It was literally flattened took a direct hit, the plant. It did. And so the factory was destroyed. Uh, the German government, or the republic there, felt like it was so important for the Blutner piano to be rebuilt uh, that they provided the, the funds and uh, means necessary for the Blutner factory to be rebuilt so that they could continue on. Well, for the world of music and the piano world, that's a good thing they did because this is absolutely an incredible, incredible piano. Now, Blutner is still family owned and operated as well. That's correct. Since 1853, they've uh, been, it's been in the family itself, and so you have the personal care and pride of the family ownership. The inside of the rim, the wood that you see there is babinga. It's a wood made in Africa, and it's, uh, it's a beautiful trim for the inside of the piano. All of the materials that are involved in the Blutner piano are the very finest that can be had. And then the workmanship that goes along with that creates an instrument that is truly world class. Now you, after 50 years of being in business, could represent just about anybody you wanted to, but you chose to represent Blutner. I think it's the finest piano in the world. Well, this comes from somebody that actually has experience working on them, first-hand knowledge of the inside mechanical componentry and qualities. So that says a lot. 
It does. Uh, I think the, not only the workmanship, the beauty of it, the tone, the things that most people will want in a, in a fine piano is the sound. It has to sound better than anything else that they can play. Uh, the touch has to be uh, something that uh, encourages their playing and enhances their playing. So they sound better on this piano than they do on any other. Yeah. Would you mind uh, giving us a demonstration? All right. The richness is incredible, just unbelievable. Um, and the power that it has, it's just it's a great, uh, great piano. Big event coming up here in August. August 16th through the 19th. This is our grand, grand piano sale. Uh, and we call it that simply because we'll be featuring some grand pianos, but the grandest of all, the Blutner, piano will also be on sale for that sale. Many times in a sale, the high end, the top of the line is excluded, but not in this case. Not in this case. This will be the first time ever that we've included the Blutner. In a sale. So anybody who's ever dreamt of owning a Blutner and wants to get a deal of a lifetime, they want to come down to the grand, grand piano sale. Now's the time. August 16th. Through the 19th. Through the 19th at Carpenter's Music World. Thank you.